Hi, I'm Tim Hankowich. Hi, I'm Caitlin Hartman. So on November 16th and 17th, we are presenting Home Alone, Film with Music. And if you ever haven't been to one of these before, it's where we present the film in its entirety, where the musical soundtrack has been scrubbed and Orchestra Iowa will play it in real time. Some of the coolest things that we do, but I also know that Home Alone is actually one of your favorite movies. It absolutely is. Ever since I was a little girl, I love, love, love this movie and watch it at least a couple times every season. I kid you not. You need to bring your entire family to this. My sister's birthday is on Sunday the 17th, which is the second day that we're performing it. And she might even be coming from Canada to actually see it. That's how special this movie is. Well, I traveled to see this performance last year with the Chicago Symphony, and it is well worth the trip. <laughs> yeah, well, they're a pretty good band, but so are we. So what are you most looking forward to it oh gosh everything every single part of this score is magical to me you even asked when it, you asked me does it start with the 20th century fox theme yes i couldn't tell tell her right away because i had to wait for the music to arrive and yes it does so that famous fanfare it starts the whole thing and that gave you chills didn't it it did and the entire audience at the uh, cso gasped there was an audible gasp in the whole place the air was just sucked out of the whole theater <gasps> Because it was so, it, it just set the scene perfectly for right. a magical experience to come. Now, everyone also knows that over the summer, we were raising funds for this instrument called a Celesta. And we used it last week for our Harry Potter concert. And we're going to be using it a lot for this one as well. It's that magical bell-like uh, instrument that's a keyboard instrument. But that's also the, na that's also the instrument that gives the whole uh, soundtrack magic. Ever since uh, in the Nutcracker, when you hear Sh Dance of the Sugar Plum Fairy, for 150 years, that one instrument signifies magic and it's just been associated in our culture for that long and so it's used to great effect throughout this entire film but uh, as always John Williams just knows how to set the tone for this really funny and sweet uh, holiday tradition. Yes I agree and one thing that I think he does so well in this uh, movie it's it's special not everything is strictly symphonic composed by John Williams. Right. He blends in popular music, um, a little Motown, I think, is little even Mo A little in Motown is in there, a little bit of Grinch is in yes, there yes, as well. Right. Oh, yeah. And of course, mm -hmm. uh, some, some standard carols. And by the way, uh, joining the orchestra are two choirs, high school courses, one from Linmar and the other from Jefferson High School. And they're also going to be helping us fulfill this uh, soundtrack as these things sing things like Oh Holy Night and uh, Somewhere in My Memory and Carol of the Bells and all that stuff. So there's a vocal requirement that we really reached out to our community. So it's a really community effort, actually, that's bringing this project together. It's going to be a really special night. November 16th and 17th. Take your entire family, it's gonna be a whole lot of fun and start the Christmas season early. We'll see you then.